Happy Valentine's Day from Brown Dog Gadgets. To celebrate the wonderful beating of a loving heart, we're going to try to make a fun heart rate monitor t-shirt using a few simple parts. You're going to need a Crazy Circus Robotics board, a 3-pin male header, a red LED, and a pulse sensor from PulseSensors.com, or we got ours off Amazon. If you want to use a battery holder, you'll need a screw terminal part as well. For the actual sewing of this project, you'll need conductive thread, you also need a shirt to sew the project onto, as well as some extra fabric, some regular thread, needles, and scissors. The first thing you want to do is lay out your parts on your shirt. You'll then want to start sewing them down using regular thread. This is particularly helpful when sewing on a shirt, as shirts are often very awkward to sew on or sew with. Use your regular thread and sew on your parts. We're first sewing on our screw terminal and our robotics board because those are the most easy to get to. Be sure not to use regular thread in the holes you'll be using for your conductive thread, otherwise it just gets a bit too busy and tight in there. Conductive thread is typically quite conductive. What you need to watch out for is your connection point with the PCB. Make sure to do several tight loops around each of the contact points to make sure you have a solid connection. Next, run thread from your robotics board, the A5, the ground, and the 5 volt, up to your 3-pin male header. The number one most common mistake for conductive sewing projects at this complexity level are short circuits, thread that keeps coming in contact with other thread. Make sure you leave yourself quite a bit of space between each of your thread lines and that you have no random strands of thread making contact with other thread on the backside. Lastly, you'll be connecting your LED to digital pin 9 and a ground. We also threw a nice little felt heart on there for a fun embellishment, because why not? Because the pulse sensor cable is not long enough to go the entire way down our shirt arm, we're using some female-to-female -female jumpers to help connect that to our 3-pin male terminal. What we did was after we connected them, we also sewed down those wires to make sure that they weren't flailing all over or catching on things. We're using the Arduino basic sketch off PulseSensors.com to run our shirt. Download the code from them and upload it to your robotics board. In the code, be sure to change your input to pin 5 and your digital output for your LED to pin 9. Quick and simple change. Attach a 3 AAA or 3 AA battery holder to your screw terminal or power the entire project from a USB power bank. You can find diagrams, links to the code, and step-by-step -step picture directions at crazycircus.com. We hope you had fun looking at our shirt and enjoy watching our heartbeat, because we sure are.